Well, I think that uh, the value they bring to this community is, is just tremendous. I mean, the services that you provide for different agencies, uh, your after-school programs, uh, all the things that you do here, uh, Billings could not survive without these programs. Every December, uh, we give a car away to a family that doesn't have a car, uh, that, that deserves a car. And what we do is that uh, we find a car and our technicians and uh, our body people, uh, they uh, fix those free of charge, or they don't charge anything. And um, I buy the parts for the vehicle. We get it all cleaned up. Uh, then we ask United Way to go out into the community and ask your partners uh, to submit some names and then you go through those and screen those and then you give us about eight or ten names and we have a committee uh, at the dealership that uh, looks at those. Uh, I have, Mary and I have nothing to do with that, it's all employee driven. I can think of one instance where a lady, a uh, single mom, uh, was working two jobs, didn't have a car, took the bus, uh, children went to the Friendship House after school, and they walked home from there. And uh, that was a well-deserving person for that, uh, for that car. We need skilled workers in this community, and I right now probably have at least five to seven openings uh, that we can't find people. Uh, but the, the uh, people that we need need to have skills and <clears throat> if they don't read by the third grade they're not going to get those skills because it seems like that the process here in the schools are that uh, I call it no, no child left behind because they just graduate and graduate and graduate and they might not have those skills and that's, that's really important that they have those skills. We now, uh, um, I think we have four employees now from, the, uh, from either the Career Center or City College that's employed at our dealership. And they have the skills and that's what it takes, uh, the skills to get it done.